Yes, Merit, can you hear me again? Merit, hear me a call loss. Hi, Mr. Prashant, are you? Okay. Merit, Merit, in fact, Rachi lost its connection and I asked you to wait for two minutes by the time Rachi by the time Rachi log in again. That is why I that is why I said Merit, is it okay with you? Yes, Merit you say see for this person that it happened in India. Rachi again said see. Rachi in fact already said this option C. Yes, C is the correct answer. It happened in India is autobiography of father of retail industry in India, Kishore Biani, the chief convener of Future Group. Future Group. Future Group was launched by Kishore Biani, the famous owner of Pantaloon, Big Bazaar, and Hometown, etc. We all are famous brands of Future Group and chief convener of Future Group, Kishore Biani, wrote a book. It happened in India. Rati itself, Gleevec is, is a product of no artist, a Swiss pharma company, no artist. Happened in India, written by Kishore Biani, father of retail industry in India. Kishore Biani. Question 6 Which of the following countries of G8 became the latest member of WTO? Friends, you know that G8 is a group of eight nations which are most developed and the richest. Group of eight nations, richest nations of the world. The question is that one country out of G8 nations recently became the member of WTO. What is the answer? Merit says Italy. Options are France, Japan, Italy, and Russia. Merit says C, Italy. Yes, Rachi, what is your answer for this question? Agra, Agra, can you hear me? Rachi C, Merit or D. Eight nations of G H are USA, UK, Canada, France, Germany, Italy, Japan, and Russia. Seven nations who are already member of WTO. Russia. Russia applied membership of WTO but it was rejected continuously due to the marketing spat of Russia. Russia being a socialist country did not get the proper or the prior acceptance from WTO till June 2012. On 23rd June 2012, Russia became formally a member of the WTO. Option D is the correct one, friends. Not Italy. Italy is the wrong one. It's D. Option 6, option B. Russia became the not newest or latest because after Russia got a proper membership, some other nations also brought, but out of G8 nations, Russia is the latest to find a place in the membership of WTO. It's D, Russia is the answer.
Question seven: Which of the following countries is the largest producer of uranium? An important question: Australia, Canada, China, or Kazakhstan? Largest producer of uranium. Yes, friends. Rachi and Medat. Rachi and Medat, can you tell me the number of students attending the session? Yes, dear Rachi and Medat, can you tell me the number of students attending this session? Merit, uh, yes, there are 20. Good. Rachi, what about you? Rachi. Okay, friends. Come to the person again. Australia was country with largest deposits of uranium, but Canada was the largest producer of uranium till 2012. In 2012, the place is taken by Kazakhstan. Kazakhstan is now world's largest producer of uranium. That's why this point, this question becomes important. In other sense, India signed a serial nuclear deal with Kazakhstan last year. Under the deal, Kazakhstan will produce uranium to be used as fuel at civil nuclear plants. Rachi is disappointing in fact. But nevertheless, one is enough and what it is not zero question seven comes with right option option d kazakhstan rachi did you get the answer for question number seven it is kazakhstan rachi it's d kazakhstan kazakhstan is now worse Largest uranium producing country. Question 8. Recently, which of the following countries was on the verge of fiscal drive? Fiscal drive is an economic term. Recently, a country was on the verge of fiscal drive. Later, the government of that particular country declared a waiver to withstand fiscal drive. Options are Russia, Brazil, China or USA. Fiscal drive, I, I want to explain you what is fiscal drive. Fiscal drive is a situation which arises in an economy when the savings rate is quite low, spendings are high and interest are high. Yes, Meerat and Rasi, not, not, too, not too tough question. Why you are taking so much time to answer this question? There are two or three more important events in the world of economy. Sovereign European debt crisis, the crisis which was faced by uh, countries of Europe like Cyprus, Greece, Portugal, etc. The Fiscal drive in USA in 2012, Obama government faced a worrying situation of economy. It was fiscal drive. USA is the answer, friends. Merit? No, China. In fact, China being a communist country, either the world is not getting any negative information of about information about its economy. Or in fact, China is not facing such type of any economic crisis. It is USA, 
Meerat and Rachi, did you get the answer? The country which was on the verge of fiscal drag. USA. Interest rates were quite high, spending was quite high, savings were low. Meerat and Rachi, did you get the answer? Proper explanation for question number 8. The country facing the situation of fiscal drag. Merit and Rachi, friends, I want to tell you again that it is not a, uh, not a speech, not a lecture. In fact, in fact, it is a conversation. It is an interaction. And until, uh, until unless you are not putting your option, your queries, your quick response, the liability of the session expires. Rachi and Merit, Rachi log out again. Merit, did you get the proper answer? Merit, yes, Merit. If you are there, my whole soul concern is with you. Merit, did you get the answer? Thank you, Merit. Thank you. Please be first while replying and be a little more alert and more vital. Question 8. Again, Merit, just wait for a single minute. For Rachi. Fiscal trend happens when the government net fiscal position means spending minus taxation fails to cover the net savings. Low rate of savings, high rate of taxation, high rate, high rate of spending all result in fiscal drag. We should move, uh, should we move to the next question? Merit, since the strength at the Merit Center is quite attractive, 20 students. So my most concern is with you Merit right now. Rachi is left only with single stream. Agra either does not exist or there are no students at Agra. And Rachi is with only one student. So Agra, my whole attention is towards you. Agra, thank you Agra. Sorry, thank you Merit. Thank you, Merit. Question number nine. The union government has announced the constitution of 14th Finance Commission under the chairmanship of YB Reddy and Govindra Sudipto Manjali or Abhijit Singh. Finance Commission. First, read the question, give me the answer. I will explain you more about Finance Commission. Some two or three lines. Very smart, Merit. Your answer comes as soon as possible. Finance Commission is a constitutional body under Article 280 of Indian Constitution. It is a body which decides or distributes the funds between cent and state. YB Reddy is the current chairman or the incumbent chairman of 14th Finance Commission. 12th Finance Commission was headed by C. Rangarajan, 11th by Vijay Kekar, 10th by K. C. Pan. The tenure for the 14th Finance Commission would be 2015 to 2010. Option A is the correct one. Ex governor of RBI, incumbent chairman of 14th commission. Question 10 
moving cash is a mobile wallet which offers facilities such as fund transfer, bill payment, balance inquiry, mini statement, mobile top ups and DTS recharge has been launched by PNB. Yes, Rashi, I'm coming to you. Oh, God. Rashi and Agra, Rashi and Meerat, alternately you lose your connection and that's why it needs to be repeated. Rashi, question number seven. Kazakhstan is the world's largest uranium producer. Question eight. Essentially, USA Face the crisis of fiscal drag. Question number eight is the option of B as well. Rachi, did you get that? Yes, Rachi. Did you get the answer for question number seven and eight? Thank you, Rachi. Uh, this time, Merit loses its connection. We should wait for two minutes for Merit. Rachi, no need to say thanks. It's always my pleasure. I'm here to help you. Just please be there. Please be in touch while the session concludes. My pleasure always, Rachi. Wait for marriage to log in because the marriage has substantial number of students present and attending the session. Substantial number of students. Welcome back, Meerut. Can you hear me now? Meerut, can you hear me now? Rachi, can you? CL Meerut, thank you, Rachi. Meerut, what about you? You and Rachi both alternatively lose the connection. Yes, thank you. Come to the next question. Uh, Rachi, did you, uh, Rachi, did you get the question number nine? The incumbent or the future chairman of 14th Finance Commission. Rachi, give the answer for this question. Yes, why we ready is the current Declared chairman of the Team Finance Commission. Now we should move to the next person, which is about Mobile Cash Easy. 
function is the movie cash is a mobile wallet which offers facilities such as fund transfer, bill payment, balance required, release statement, mobile promo, etc. has been launched by SPAN. BNB, SBI, Premier Bank of India or ICICI. Answer for this question and please write your option followed by question number. Like if you want to answer for question number 10, write 10 dash A, B, C, D. Nancy says D. Dr. Mayor, what do you say? Meerat, you answer for this question? Yes, Meerat. Meerat, your response for any question is as important as anything. Because you have the substantial number of students, had the number of students who are less, or could it be quite few, I could ignore your option, your response, your query, but not this time. Merit, please answer for this question. Merit, Merit, can you hear me? See your Merit. Yes, merit answer for this question, question number 10. State Bank of India has launched Mobi Cash KG with the help of Oxygen as a technology partner. Option B is the correct one for question number 10. Option B. Yes, Meerat Handachi, is it okay? Is it okay to move the next question? Meerat Handachi, is it okay now to move to the next question? Yes, Meerat, should we? Meerat, I told you again that your response is, your response is most important for me for this particular session. Yes, Meerat. Meerat will lose again. Rachi, do you have mic with you? I have given you the speech access. Rachi, do you have mic with you? Rachi, if you hear me, please reply. Do you have mic with you? Rachi, I have given you the speech access. Now you can talk to me. Rachi can hear me. Rachi please speak. Rachi can you hear me. Yes Rachi.
Sachi, can you hear me? Yes, Rachi, please speak. Rachi? Rachi, I am not listening to you. Rachi? Rachi, I am not listening to you. No problem, come to the chat and we are moving to the next question, question number 11, which telecom company has launched an education service that will enable its customer to access courses for English learning, competitive exam preparation and career counseling on their mobile phones. You say Bharti Airtel. Where it is nowhere. And you say Bharti Airtel and Bharti Airtel is the right answer. In January 2013, Bharti Airtel launched an education services that will enable its customers to access courses for English learning competitive exams other and other educational and career oriented counseling and education service by Airtel. Person 12. Which among the following IT or web enabled initiative has been launched by Petroleum and Natural Gas Minister to enable customers or consumers book and track refills online as well on mobile phones? Laksha. Yarachi, you are quite aware about that. Project Laksha has been delivered by Ministry of Petroleum to cut the delivery time in the supply of LPG. Option C is the correct one. Question 13, question 12, option C. Project Laksha. Yes, Rachi, I am waiting. I am waiting. Take your time, Rachi. Take your time. Yes, Rachi, is it okay? Question 11. Question 12, yes. Rachi, say now. Project Laksha launched by Ministry of Petroleum to cut the delivery time or the waiting time in the supply of LPG. The Petroleum and Natural Gas Ministry has launched Project Laksha in November 2012 to reduce the waiting time for the delivery of LPG cylinders and to track duplicate connections as well. Project Laksha by Ministry of Petroleum and Natural Gas. Person 13. Latest hybrid notebook or tablet Idea Pad Yoga has been launched by Lenovo, HP, Toshiba or Dell. Toshiba or Dell. Okay. 
you say HP, let us see what is the answer. Idea of Pad Yoga. Lost by Lenevo. Lenevo Yoga 13, a convertible laptop and PC under the name of Idea Pad Yoga 13. It is the Lenovo, the correct answer. It's option A. Option number 13, option A is the correct one. Come to question number 14. Who among the following has become the first women president of Federation of Indian Chambers of Commerce and Industries? Options are Kalpana Morparia, Naina Lalkirwari, Neelam Thawan, or Chanda Kochar. All famous business personalities. Give some extra information about it. First women president of Fikki. Yes, Rachi. What do you say? You say B. Nana Lal Kidwai. You are right. It is Nana Lal Kidwai. An Indian banker and executive group general manager and country head of HSBC. Nana Lal Kidwai. Interesting question, interesting information about Naina Lal Kidwai. First, Indian graduate from Harvard. First, Indian graduate from Harvard, Naina Lal Kidwai. First, Indian graduate from Harvard is Naina Lal Kidwai. Country head of HSBC. Some information about Kalpana Morpariya. Any any idea about Kalpana Morpariya? Yes, friends. Any answer for Kalpana Morpariya? Have you have you heard about J.P. Morgan and Chase? J.P. Morgan and Shea Company, in fact, J.P. Morgan and Shea. C. C. First of all, J.P. Morgan and Company. She is the CEO of J.P. Morgan and Company. A U.S. based and investment company. A US based and investing company JP Morgan, headed by Karna Morpanya. Neelam Dhawan, any answer for Neelam Dhawan? Yes, friends. Current MD of HP India. Neelam Dhawan is currently. MD of HP India and Chanda Kochar, you must know about Chanda Kochar. Chanda Kochar, Shikha Sarma. Indra Nui, Nana Lankidwai, Kiran Majumdar Shah. Yeah, it's ICICICU, Chanda Kochar. And friends, it's 14. Answer is option B. Nana Lankidwai. 15. As per the data released by the Planning Commission of India, which state became the fastest growing state in India at 10.9% between 2006 and 2010, Haryana, Gujarat, Maharashtra, or Bihar? Yes, friends, any answer for this question? The state with the highest rate of growth Ma 
महाराष्ट्र Any special reason to choose Maharashtra? Yes, friends. Gujarat has been left behind by Bihar. Bihar is the answer. Chiyans for Bihar. Bihar is the answer. Option D. Bihar is the answer for this question. According to the Planning Commission data, Bihar was the slowest growing state during 2005 five period with GDP up to only 2.9%. However, between 2006 and 2010, Bihar became the highest growing state and it has left behind Gujarat. Option D. Bihar is the correct one. Question 15, 16. Which airlines recently has launched the first ever civil aviation services between Kargil and Jammu? Mantra Airlines, Deccan Charter, Jackson Airlines, or Spice Jet? Yes, friends, answer for this question. First, three flights from Jammu to Kargil. Any answer for this question? Don't know easy answer. Spice Jet is the first Indian flight. In fact, some private sector Indian flight to fly China. Spice Jet. Here the answer is Mantra Airlines. Mantra Airlines recently declared its flight from Jammu to Kargil, and thus it became the first civilian flight from. Jammu to Kargil. Before it, there were only taxi flights from Srinagar, Jammu, and Delhi for Kargil, especially from airports. Mantra Airlines recently, <coughs> in the month of January, started first civilian flights from Jammu, and thus Kargil gets first. Civil air connection. <coughs> question number 16, option A is the correct one. As per the Fortune 500 India list, which is the biggest company in India in terms of revenue, RIL means Reliance, Industries Limited, IOC, Indian Oil Corporation. BPCL, Bharat Petroleum, and SPCL, Hindustan Petroleum. Any answer? According to Fortune 500 India list, which is the biggest company in India as per terms of revenue? Yes, friends. You say 
Reliance India Limited. On the basis of the market capitalization RIL still largest Indian company. But Indian Oil Corporation is the biggest company in terms of revenue followed by Reliance Industries in the latest list declared by Forbes 500 in December 2012. Indian Oil Corporation followed by Reliance Industries followed by Bharat Petroleum. So IOC is the Rachi, Rachi, can you hear me? Yes, Rachi. Rachi, can you hear me? I repeat, in the latest list declared by Fortune 500 in the month of December 2012, Indian Oil Corporation is the biggest company in terms of revenue followed by Reliance Industries and the third place is owned by Bharat Petroleum. Question 17, option B is the correct one. IOC, Indian Oil Corporation is the correct answer. Question 18, who among the following has been signed, has been signed or had signed, in fact, brand ambassador in India by Blackberry smartphone maker research in motion. Ranbir Kapoor, Shahrukh Khan, Amir Khan, or Deepka Patkar. As you know, Canada based research in motion, research in motion com company, the parent company of Blackberry has declared that now it would be known by its name Blackberry itself and it has signed a deal with Ranveer Kapoor. Ranveer Kapoor currently the brand ambassador of Tata Jokomo has signed a new deal with Blackberry. Option A is the correct one. Thank you. Question 19. As per the Global Competitiveness Report 2012-13, which country has topped list released by World Economic Forum? Sweden, Switzerland, Singapore or Finland. Global competitiveness list. Yes, friends. Any answer for this question? You say B, Switzerland. Yeah, it is the correct answer. Switzerland has topped the list of the global competitiveness 2012-13 released by World Economic Forum. Can you tell me the rank of India? Yes, friends, India. The rank of India. Below 10, most safe answer below 10. <coughs> Any correction? Since Rachi, only you are present with a single student. Now I just entertain you. Take your time. Yeah, it's 100 plus. Below 100 is quite a good answer.
some more information you know about BRICS nations do you know about BRICS nations Brazil and all that stuff of Brazil India and uh, India Russia China South Africa and Brazil I am providing you just some information, more information to that. Among the BRICS economies, only Brazil moves up 48 from 53. India is again placed at 59th rank as well. Russia below India. It's 59, Rachi. Which is the largest lending bank? What's in Kanji? Which is the largest lending bank? PMB, ICICI, Bank of Baroda, State Bank of India, definitely. Largest number of branches. Largest. Public Sector Bank of India, SBI, ranks number one in the lending in India. Option D is the correct one. 21. India's average GDP growth during 1990-2010 is to be at 9%, 7%, 6.6% or 8%. India's average GDP growth during 1990-2010. D or A. The latest list or the latest data was published by WTO. India is good with average growth rate of 6.6% during the past decade of 1990 to 2010 by the data released by WTO and World Bank. It's option C. It's option C friends. It is almost 6.5% more precisely it's option C 6.6% Percent. Who is the current president of World Bank? Jim Yong Kim, Pascal Lenny, Ajay Banga, or Christian Lagarde? World Bank. <coughs> Christian Lagarde, our French national, is MD of IMF or International Monetary Fund. Ajay Banga is CEO of MasterCard. Pascal Lemmy is head of WTO. Jim Young Kim, a South Korean national, is head of World Bank. Option A is the correct one. Question number 22, option A is the correct one. Jim Yong Kim. 23, which is also known as paper gold, ATM card, US dollar, special drawing price, or STR, or scheme of the government which has not been implemented. Paper gold. Yes, friends, any answer for this question? Paper gold.
to say ATM card thrown in paper gold. I wonder how you can consider ATM card as paper gold. Can you explain? Rachi, can you explain me? Yes, Rachi. The special drawing rights issued by IMF are known as golden rights, golden drawing rights or paper gold. These are the these are type of supplement of foreign exchange reserves, SDR, special drawing rights issued by IMF are known as paper gold. 24, which is the current chief of IMF, Rodrigo Rato, Michael Camedesas, Christian Ligard, and Dominic Stroscom. Oh my god, which is the if the question you follow by a star, which denotes its answer, question. Regard definitely, chief of IMF, before her, the post was held by Dominic Strauss Khan. Allegedly, he was found in some controversies, and following the event, Christian Regard became the acting chief of IMF, and after that, she was appointed the permanent chief of IMF. Option number 24, option C, most obvious answer. 25, a question with um, long language, which among the following airlines of UAE has offered free flights for 10 year old passengers under certain conditions as a part of a year-long celebration of the airline's 10th anniversary. Etihad Airways, Emirates, Air Arabia, or Aerovista Airlines. Yes, friends. Option 25 comes with right option option A with Etihad Airways and Airways of UAE Etihad Airways essentially declares in the month of January 2013 that it will launch a scheme for passengers under the age of 10 years as a free pass to fly to UAE. Option 35, option A. 26. First country of the world which has launched construction of fourth generation nuclear power plant with a 200 megawatt for commercial use. China, Japan, Germany, or France. Fourth generation nuclear plants. First country to launch fourth generation nuclear power plants. Any answer? Germany. I want to tell you that Germany has declared that by the year 2020 or 2022, it is going to shut down its all nuclear reactors to produce other options for the renewable energy. Germany is totally discarded. It cannot be the answer. Again, give me the fresh answer. Yes? Yeah, it's China. In fact, in most of the countries, fourth generation nuclear reactors are under construction or under research, and it is stipulated that not before 2030 any country would start fourth generation nuclear reactors, but China has declared that it is going to establish world's fourth generation nuclear reactor 
of 200 megawatt capacity option a china is the correct answer 27 word of day is celebrated on march 21 march 20 april 22 or march 20 word of day word of day rachi is a d march 22 then what is world water day rachi what is world water day march 22 is celebrated as world water day april 22 is celebrated as world earth day it is option c friends world earth day march 22 celebrated as world water day world earth day is celebrated as on april 22 rachi is it okay question 28 asian development bank is headquartered at jakarta hong kong manila or singapore i want to tell you that the next meeting of abb asian development bank is going to be held at expo mart greater noida just in front of career launcher head office at knowledge park greater noida from 2 to 5 may 2013 next meeting of adb adb is headquartered at jakarta asian development bank or the world bank which acts as world bank for asia in generally the by tradition the chairman or the president of adb comes from japan because japan Uh, Japan supports or helps ADB most, and headquartered at Jakarta. Yes, you are right. Option is the correct one. Oh. Sorry, friends. Sorry, I think there is some confusion. Yeah, ADB. Asian Development Bank. Now I hear you say option A is wrong. One is Manila. ADB. ADB is headquartered at Manila, Philippines. I'm extremely sorry. Extremely sorry for the negligence. Established in 1966, ADB. Based at Manila, Philippines. Option C is the correct one. It is option C, Manila. Twenty nine. The government of India has increased the import duty on platinum and gold from four percent to five percent, eight percent, six percent, or seven percent. Import duty on gold. Yes, friends. Answer for this question. Yeah, four percent to six percent due to increasing demands in domestic market for gold and increasing CAD or the capital account deficit. government decided to increase import duty on gold from 4% to 6% or the 2 percentage hike to curb the demand for gold and to control the increasing capital account deficit option 29 option c is the correct one one thing more or they decided that it will link the gold exchange trade fund for ETF with gold deposit scheme 
which will enable mutual funds to unlock their fiscal gold and invest in gold linked schemes offered by banks to control the CAD or the increasing ground current account deficit. Option C is the correct one. Friends, this is the last question for you. Steve Jobs, a book has been written by Walter Jackson, Neil James, Paul Cookman, or Jimmy Wales. Walter Jackson wrote the biography of Steve Jobs, famous business leader, died in 2011. <coughs> Neil James has written a famous book which comes under best seller Fifty Shades of Grey. Yeah, that's it. You are smart. Paul Krugman is a famous economist, a regular communist in different international journals. He also received Nobel Prize in Economics and Jimmy Wales is yes. Any idea about Jimmy Wales? Wikipedia. Creator of Wikipedia, Jimmy Wales. So friends, this was all about the session for GK3 for PBA. Now thank you, and uh, I I also wish to send my contact details. You can be touch in any time for any type of query. This is the mobile contact and my mail ID is Thank you friends. These are the contact, contact details. You can contact me at any time. I will be pleased to help you. Thank you. Thanks all.